So this right here, this is the gameplay that I was talking about yesterday. I believe I went on like two 15 kill streaks. Ended up dying on both of them because I was just, you know, I was playing a little bit too aggressive as always. So no DNA bomb, but I mean, come on, if you think about it, if you put both 15 kill streaks together, that equals 30, and that's technically a DNA bomb. So before we get too far into today's video, there's something that I kind of wanted to bring up, and I wanted your guys' thoughts and opinions on it. So I woke up this morning, didn't really have anything to do, so you know, I figured I might as well go ahead and you know hook up my Xbox 360 for a change, go ahead and play some of the older Call of Duties, have some fun. So for today I hopped on Black Ops 2 and I never realized how much fun the game is. Now it's a little bit different than Advanced Warfare, it's a lot slower paced and you know there's not EXO movement and you can't be like halfway across the map in a matter of seconds. But I put on a sniper and I went into a free for all lobby and it seems like everybody just loves sniping now. It seems like that's all free for all really is these days. And I was hitting all kinds of cool clips, I mean I was getting triples, doubles, I mean even a few quads here and there. And I thought to myself, you know, I'm actually doing pretty well. I really enjoy Black Ops 2. Like, I would definitely go back to this game and play it a couple times a week. And I thought, you know, maybe should I share it with you guys? Would you guys want to see, like, maybe one or two Black Ops 2 videos a week? Have you guys already seen Black Ops 2 for a year straight when the game came out so you don't want to see any more of it? Just share your opinions. If you do want to see it, please do tell me in the comment section down below. I would love to hear that. I would definitely, like, I could definitely make Black Ops 2 videos for you guys. That would not be a problem at all. But I mean, if you're already tired of it and you've seen like more than enough of it since it's an old Call of Duty, also please do tell me that in the comment section down below. And if you guys don't want to see it, then that's no big deal either. I just I figured I'd go ahead and throw the option out there just in case you guys you know wanted to see it or not. Wanted to make sure you guys are you know getting the content that you enjoy as always. Your boy Machiavelli just so nice to his subscribers. Okay, in between making this commentary, I figured I would go ahead and open my supply crates for the day. And I just opened up my supply drop and got a silver bullet, a more silver bullet. So now I have both the silver bullet and the doctor. That's crazy. I'm going to have to make a video with the silver bullet later on today. Uh, it's not really a very good weapon to just snipe with in general, but it's great for trick shotting. Uh, the damage is higher, so you're obviously going to get less hit markers, but it shoots a lot slower. So within the time you could shoot one bullet of the silver bullet, you could have shot like maybe two or three of the doctor. So like I said, it's not really good to just use for killing people, but if you want a trick shot and make sure you don't get a hit marker on your trick shot, it's an absolutely perfect, probably the best version of the Moors out there. So I'll have to show you guys that later on. <laughs> I don't know why I included that in today's commentary. I just figured I would tell you guys since I just got it like 15 seconds ago, but super hyped about that. <laughs> Anyways, on to the commentary again. If you guys didn't notice, I'm making this video on February 20th. It is also going up today. So double XP has started today. Double XP usually generally lasts over the entire weekend, so from Friday, I don't remember until what time, but I think until early Monday morning. It depends on your time zone. But yeah, until early Monday morning, for me at least, there's double XP. So if you're trying to rank up in Advanced Warfare and whatnot, make sure to go ahead and play as much as you can this weekend. Double XP helps out a ton, and I mean, you never know. Maybe you'll get some extra double XP in your supply drops, and then you can get four times XP. I mean, that's like, you rank up insanely fast when that happens, so... Like I said, if you're trying to prestige, reach Master Prestige, or whatever prestige you know you really want, then this is definitely the weekend for you to play. Uh, I'm actually surprised at how many double XP weekends Advanced Warfare has had. It seems like at least once or twice a month they have a double XP weekend, and I mean, I'm not complaining, because who doesn't love some extra double XP? But I remember like back all the way in maybe, what was it, MW3 maybe it was? It seemed like they only had a double XP weekend every time the maps came out, or something crazy like that. So it's nice to see Call of Duty doing it more frequently. I mean, all the players could definitely use it. We all appreciate it. I mean, even if you're level 50, it's still kind of cool to see your friends rank up fast, see how hard or see how high up in rank they can get over the weekend. I mean, technically, if you played the entire weekend and just did nothing but play Call of Duty, you could go up like two or three prestiges, maybe even four if you were like trying super hard. But yeah, I'm not about the double XP. So yesterday, in today's video, I made sure to ask you guys towards the end of it, like, hey. Do you guys want to see a questions and answers video? And I received a ton of positive feedback about that. It seems like almost all of you out there want to hear a questions and answers video. So with that being said, I will definitely do a questions and answers video, but it's going to be something special. So right now I'm at like 3,900 subscribers and I think that I can hopefully get 5,000 subscribers within the next two or three weeks. I mean, it depends how things go. I mean, if, it, if things are going like they are now, then I'll definitely be at 5,000 subscribers within the next two or three weeks. So. With that being said, I will gladly do a questions and answers video for 5,000 subscribers. Uh, I'm not going to ask for questions yet. I'll probably ask for questions a day or two before the video goes up. But just keep an eye out for that. Uh, I am working harder on getting the face cam. It shouldn't be too much longer now. You know, I just want to do things to improve the quality of my video. I'm going to start doing more live commentary soon. Probably around the same time that I get a face cam. 
But whenever I try to do a live commentary with the Elgato capture card, it just, the audio gets like put behind and it's it messed up. I still haven't figured that out yet. I'll have to mess with it some more today. It was fine when I first did a live commentary, but it's, it's starting to be really weird again. Like I said, I'll look into that later. Here's towards the end of the video. Here you see my second 15 kill streak, and of course, you know, I'm gonna spoil it as always. I end up dying like right here, not right here, but within the next two or three seconds. So, like I said, two, I don't, maybe they were 18 kill streaks, I don't remember. Two 15 plus kill streaks in this gameplay, pretty cool. Still no DNA bomb, but <laughs> once again, I always fail it, and uh, I noticed a lot of you guys have been commenting on my recent videos lately. I cannot thank you guys enough. When you comment, it makes me super happy to see that you guys are giving me feedback on the video. You know, just enjoying it overall, and just letting me know that you guys are watching it. So, you guys are awesome. I cannot thank you guys enough for being the best subscribers in the entire world, and I will see you guys all for tomorrow's upload. Well done,